plus a DORV of a TGA type on a fetal echo? Yes, please subscribe the channel so that I can give you more educational videos. Uh, see this patient where this is a right ventricle, that's the pulmonary artery, that's an aorta, aorta is anterior, you see there are coni below the pulmonary artery and below aorta, so there are two coni which indicate this is DORV and there is a pulmonary stenosis, PA is smaller than aorta. Same thing on a power Doppler, you see this is aorta, this is pulmonary artery, this is narrow here indicating DORV of a TGA type and pulmonary stenosis. What do we do in this patients when uh, the surgery has to be done? And let's say this is a patient of a DORV, both aorta pulmonary artery arising from uh, RV and this is a TGA type, both are transposed and this is what is happening, blood is going to both, we obstruct the blood by putting a patch on the VSD and now the, with the patch the blood from LV goes to pulmonary artery and RV goes to aorta. So we converted the uh, DORV into TGA. The next step is that we reverse the vessels, we do an arterial situation so that the RV gets pulmonary artery and LV gets aorta. But in case this patient develops a severe pulmonary stenosis as the pregnancy continues, we have to do more difficult surgeries and if it's very very severe, we have to sacrifice the pulmonary valve and put a conduit good idea to subscribe the channel so that you are notified as and when i post a new video